Good morning, YouTube. I'm still in old, I'm still in old North Dayton, about five minutes from where I did the the video about the traffic light back there at Valley Street in St. Adelbert. And you are looking at the intersection of Valley and Stanley. And the point of this video is the red light traffic cameras have recently got have been in the news once again in Ohio. This week there's a there's a uh, red light traffic camera right here at this intersection you could see it right here and uh and so these have recently got some news this way because uh there's a house bill that's pending in the senate right now that is uh talking about if they don't that if cities do not staff these at all times with the police officer on all sides of it that they're gonna be removed or they will not be able to use these anymore without a police officer and there's about I don't know about 30 or 40 of these in the city of Dayton there's other cities in Montgomery County that have these Trotwood and West Carrollton and other communities that are not in Montgomery County that have them as well like Springfield and the city leaders are saying, well, if we have to put a cop at these, we're not going to be able to use these because there's no way we have the manpower. And of course, I would not be surprised if the city of Dayton and other city leaders, of course, you know, they're going to be begging, saying, oh, we need these for safety, which is really a crock of crap. And they're saying it's for safety. We all know these are for revenue so you know they'll be probably begging the politicians probably that are you know behind you know talking about forcing them to staff these with uh forcing them to staff these with police officers saying oh there's no way we can do it we'll we'll lose more money that way and all this other fluff crap and we'll lose money of course this is all under a scam about you know for safety but we all know it's about you know revenue and all this other stuff as I said in the previous video I did videos of this neighborhood before the old North Dayton neighborhood this used to be known as the Polish village that's not really applicable anymore it's more so a mixed neighborhood now a lot of Turks a lot of Middle Eastern immigrants live in this neighborhood now and so forth so you can see this is a pretty Highly traveled intersection. It's Friday morning around 9 a.m. And uh, and I chose this intersection because, well, there's uh, there's uh, there's several other locations I could have picked, but the other one around uh, the other ones around were just too busy to to really use for this video. This one is not as highly traveled as like Third and Kiwi and so on so I wanted to get this in there so hopefully hopefully this you know hopefully this legislation that's pending that they won't listen to the crybaby city leaders of cities like Dayton and they actually do go through with the plans to actually force them to staff these which you know they won't be able to do so they'll have to cut this you know revenue cash cow scam you know but anyway YouTube I just wanted to get that in there let you guys know what was going on you know with the red light cameras in Ohio because there has been a case that's been pending in front of the Supreme Court but I have not heard anything about that about the about the legality of these red light traffic cameras but I just wanted to, you know, get that in there about this, you know, scam, you know, right here. You can see this is a fairly busy and well-traveled, you know, intersection right here. So let me know what you guys think about these traffic light cameras because we all know the city leaders are going to be begging, you know, who's ever, you know, behind you know, this legislation saying, oh, there's no way we can staff these. We're going to lose money. And they're going to say, well, we need them for safety and all this other fluff crap. And we know 
you know that's a lie but anyway i just wanted to get that in about this red light camera and let you guys know what's going on but that's it for this one